My name is Musoma from Dose Idea. In this short video, I'm going to demonstrate the procedures for removing extra accounts for students. The whole process begins when you have added all the students in the system. So you will start with verifying that all the students are in the system. Go to scholars, scholars analysis, then generate number of scholars in the school enrollment. Specify the study year and the study term, which is the current. Then you verify that all class students, at least they are there by their totals, as you can see in this table. So we can generate a class list of senior 1A to confirm that those are the students we have. Still, it is under scholars menu, scholars analysis, scholars in a class, state the study year and the current study term. Then we choose our class as senior 1, stream senior 1A. You may want to generate with the photos or no, those options are there for you to utilize. So this is our class list of Senior 1A. You can always print out these class lists by clicking on print so that you will give it to the students to verify their names and the spellings of their names as well as those identifying those who are entered twice. Now here is a scenario. We have a team gen entered in the system twice so we need to remove one account now when you have verified that maybe she will remain with this account you copy the the account id the scholar id for that unwanted account then you go to you can create a new tab go to update information which is right there or alternatively you can click on the current study term and year then you go to scholar registration and class allocation you paste the id of that account you had to remove this is the id we got we copied it from here now it is right here so to remove this account you just select and register the current scholar give a reason for example scholar appears twice in the system then you unregister current scholar. By the time we go back to generate a new class list, for example, scholars in a class, and you choose senior 1A, the class list will have only one account for a team gen, as you can see. Thank you for watching. Please subscribe to this channel for new videos.